Welcome back to episode 14 of Tears of the Rinkan, where we use our very trusty Rinkan in order to play Tears of the Rinkan. And today is the day that we head all the way over into that area. The last forest, I think is what it's called. Great Hyrule Forest, whatever. Um, but before that... I, for some reason, realized that we never did this shrine that is right outside of the watchtower. We're going to do this first and then head on over. So I don't know how long it's going to take. I'm assuming it's the same, which means we need a torch. But I genuinely have no idea if it is the same. Knowing my luck, they probably changed it. Honestly. Um, but we also need... Look at this chest. And I'm noticing these... Oh, it's just gonna be these even easier. Never mind. Sure. Wait, no. Um, I need it... Oh wait, no, that's fine. Never mind. I'm dumb. I need it to be... We're centered, and then... We can just take this... And go... Oops. I just go, hey yeah. And then it's just a matter of climbing. Please don't admit. <clears throat> it's just a matter of climbing up. But, wait, buddy. What are you doing? I swear to God. Large zone I charge. Hell yeah. Poggers. Alright. Let's go inside. See what we got. But yeah, I got two of the merge pieces in so far, so I'm excited for that. I'm hoping. Spoiler for people on YouTube. I'm hoping to have it all by the time the subathon happens. Because that would be nice. For those that are on YouTube, there will be a subathon at the end of this month slash early next month. Some of it may or may not end up on the YouTube. Hey, what does this do? Okay. We want it to be off right now. There was a gap there. Yikes. So. I think. Oops. What we need to do. Is. Stab this, but it doesn't want to be stabbed right now. Understandably so. Yeah, if we just do that, then that's sticking in.
Because it's still angled. Okay. Uh, I'm also noticing there's two paths here. So I'm willing to bet. There would be something else. We should just be able to shoot these, right? No. Hmm. Hmm, because I kind of need this. I guess I probably don't. Ow. And we just time it right and, you know, use these. Thank you for throwing a penny at my forehead. Because, yeah, I think. It won't work. She. I think what we need is actually one this side. I think. Oops. All right, so if we do that, and then we grab this. And then that. And then we do that. So that opens that. But what we want is to also fuck that. <laughs> Wait for it. Oh Jesus. Okay, not quite. Get hit way sooner. I think what I actually need to do is get this out of the way first. And I th think if we do a little something like that, we should. Actually, let's grab, oops. Grab this and then go a bit, 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 bit. Slap that on. Take this and just kind of you know just just do that Second idea, we just take this. Oops. Right, and then a little something like that. And then just attach it. Now it's out of the way. Oh, you bitch. I'm dumb. So if we Oops 
do this. Get ahead of here, ball. Aim it. Okay, so we just do that. That stops that in there. Which is fine. So we grab this. Put that one there, and then it should theoretically launch it that way now. Jesus. Okay, maybe not quite. Hmm. We did it. You didn't realize I was live? Oh. Oops. To be fair, I haven't I looked at the chat since I sent the last message, so, you know. The tattoo looks awesome, by the way. Restore stamina. Okay, that's a pretty good delay eggs here. I'm excited to see it all colored in as well. Beep. All right, so now we can start making our way towards the last woods as well. Because I think we've hit all the shrines that we've been covered. during the uh shenanigans that was getting all the watchtowers we also do have to do that but there'll be one in the lost woods if i remember right unless it's changed i am also curious we'll probably hit it on saturday maybe um but like going back to wherever it is um like the very start of breath of the wild and seeing what's in there active denial that i have a tattoo portion of getting the tattoo ah gotcha so it's even gonna be like a bigger section noise bigger sleeve i guess It'd be the full forearm noise. I want to say it's like directly in front of us. That is a little creepy, not gonna lie. What is this? Blue nightshade, nice. Oh, hey, bud. Oh, that's Marge. The dull and drab woodland stable root, or the red hat foothill stable root. Red hat. Well, I was finally nodding off. What is it? You want to know what it means to be red hat? So a while back, Death Mountain was super active. We're talking full force, non-stop red hot lava. But now the lava's all cooled down and hardened into a new road that's super easily walkable. And there's nothing red hot about easily, easily walkable. Now, on the other hand, the route going up to Death Mountain from Foothill Stable. That's an old, dangerous road absolutely crawling with monsters. So if you're looking for Red Hot, that's where to find it. Thing is, my muscles aren't exactly ready to take the heat, so that makes my decision more complicated. Look, it takes sleep to burn so bright, so will you let me recharge for a bit? Okay. See ya. You guys are going cash? 
Hey, you're an idea what I see. Welcome, Link. Would you like to register a horse or take one out? I would like to take a Cheryl, please. Nope. Not cones. No offense, cones, but Cheryl. Oh. Mega. Mm. Go order take out. Yeah, Cheryl was spoiler. Um, but I guess you find out when you hit your first table. Uh, so we need to head more north ways to that way. Yeah, she's blue and got blue hair. Right this way. Yeah. 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 That's why I don't tell the other horses, Cheryl, but you're my favorite. Oops. Hey, that's the button for calming down. Let me just double check the map real quick. We may hit it. Trying to figure out how to rest your arm. Yeah, because I guess it's like here, right? So you can't even just like rest it on a desk or anything. Excuse me, coming through. Uh, oops. On a giant dick. Hey. I'm so sorry. Happy Friday. He's maybe actually an adult though, let's be honest. Cause they sure shit don't act like it sometimes, you know? Oh, the end are all starting to grow. That choo choo just fall from the fucking sky? Yeah. What the fuck was that? Oh, oh. Sorry, I thought that you were recovered. Certainly all new. Huh. Neat. Oops. Charlie, you're not gonna be too happy about walking through this, right? You're just fine, okay? Adderall did stunt your growth. I believe it. It's great. You're so easily throwable. What the fuck? Yeah. Alright, any time now, Cheryl's probably gonna freak out and not wanna continue. Yeah. So we're just going to... Oh. Um... Silent Shroom. I didn't grab a torch, did I? Is this throw off smoke? Um, no, Cheryl's fine. See? Cheryl? Cheryl? See, look, Cheryl's perfectly fine. Uh, I don't have a torch. <laughs> hmm. And it's certainly going to make and to traverse a lot more difficult. Um. Yeah, she do. She'd do that from time to time.
Because I kind of figured there would be a torch somewhere. The Lost Woods. So good, I did get the name right at least. Yeah. Yeah. My my uh fucking plushy shelf is going to be full <laughs> soon. That's for sure. Cause I got the Neow plush coming soon. You will? Yeah. Um. Interesting. I don't know where the Fuck, I have to go. Is that send a dark? Okay, I need a torch. Where can I go to get a torch? Because, I mean, there's also the, um... Just chop down a tree, you know? Turn it into wood. Oops. Drop some flint. And then strike it. Uh, is it a different way? Because it's not sending the smoke in any particular direction. Okay, it's not that way either. Because I know in Breath of the Wild, it was just hold a torch. Hmm. Um. Alright, if I had to guess, there's probably going to be a torch at that place that we passed. Whoops. Okay, sure. I don't know why you ran into the wall. I know it's kind of dark out right now, but Oh wait, is there just gonna be one here? Yep Okay Here you are Look at it's raining That tree. Oh my god, there's a few of them. Um, it's I tell lizard, nice rhino beetle. Okay, Korak friend. Oh, he says, "Pain, okay." Are these some spicy peps? No, it's a fire fruit. Okay. Hmm. Wait, fire fruit. Idea. Wrap. Um, grab this, go here, fuse, I mean low battery. I don't know if this means it's a torch now. I don't think it does. I mean, it's also rainy. Yeah, I don't think it is. Okay. Shit, are my, my earbuds almost dead? That's really not good. Pass them on charge. Yeah, it's really delayed. Shit. Okay. Alright. So, thinking somewhere in here probably has a torch. 
Oh, fuck. Okay. Maybe. Oh, it's gonna be the tar, isn't it? Yep. Hmm. Come on, here we go. Uh, I don't think we have any food, do we? I think the signs of fire fruit. I guess we do have some acorns and whatnot. Really gonna get some food. I cheated. Oh god, there's enemies nearby. Oh god. Wait, is this... This doesn't have the thing on it anymore? Scam. Flame emitter spear. Oh, wait. Yeah, hey, sure. Are we gonna go? I go right now. Like right now. All right. What is this? Up here. This is just gonna be the last ones, I'm guessing. Does have to be above? Nope. Okay. Uh, so it does put us here every time. This way. Nope. You try going this way, right? Yes. We try going this way. Let's see if we could just run back. I'm, I'm so confused. the shield and block the darkness i just don't know how the heck we're supposed to navigate the thing because like before it was with a torch but we don't have a torch you know i there's probably one at the stable Ugh. Maybe you shouldn't be here yet. 
Maybe you should shut up. I can go wherever I want, I think. I thought, I thought it was supposed to be open world. Damn it. Right, let's see if there's a torch here. Uh, I'm gonna unequip that. Go. Okay, bye bye. Wait. Wait. I wonder if these people are talking about it. Should we tell the newspaper what happened here? What happened here? Absolutely. We'll tell this whole awful story to the Lucky Clover Gazette and no one else. They'll take it seriously. I don't know how we'll get word of this to them, though. Lucky Clover Gazette is in Hebrew region. They're working out of a stable, I've heard, so... It's all so far west, though. What are you talking about? What happened here? Hey, what up? What's the Lucky Clover Gazette covered in this edition? Huh? Great fairy flees into flower bud. The great fairy, known for her love of music, was has hidden herself away in her flower bud. Nearby woodland stable is in a panic. Wait, isn't this about that giant fairy just north of here? When I get here, she was already hidden away in Center Flower Bud, troubling. I always read every word of these newspapers. What are the other stories? Oh. Blood Moon brings dangerous nights. Yeah. Be wary, dear readers. On nights when a Blood Moon rises, so too do monsters that have been defeated. Oh. Uh, this reminds me of that researcher who was studying the Blood Moon before. They were excited to visit a monster for and see what they could learn about monsters in the Blood Moon. But they didn't seem all that physically strong. I hope they're doing okay. Okay, I'll leave you two with them. It's amazing how much you can learn about the world just by spending a little time reading. All thanks to the Lucky Clover Gazette, though it does seem like they're short staffed. Could be could I be a journalist? Yeah. Go get it, bud. Oh, you're from the Yiga clan, aren't you? Ah, uh, this is quite the outfit you've put together. Although perhaps it could be a little more um coordinated, maybe. That is the fleet set could really work for you. I also just realized this is Nobu. Or Nobo, I guess. Sorry, my for fashion could help, but see what it sees. I'm forever tempted by the latest style. Same is true for my boyfriend. The two of us were going to the Goron City to buy their trendy fire-resistant clothes. But when we were about to arrive, we got tangled up with some Gorons with strange-looking rags. I guess I even came back here on my own. If you go to Goron City, then you should be careful. Okay. Maybe I will. Oh. Ah, yes, I'll be right with you. Okay. Might as well claim our reward. You like to get your pony points reward, Ryan. Your reward for three points is a towing harness. Nice. The harness is a type of horse gear that you can attach to various things. For instance, a wagon or an item you'd like to tow somewhere. If you save up just one more point, the horse god fabric will be yours. Ooh, it's a one-of-a-kind item you can bring to the Hatno Village dye shop over in Nakluda. We should go there and change our clothes and whatnot. We appreciate your patronage. If that our clothes aren't really that great, but still. Razor Shroom. Nice. Oh, this is your first time here, mister. Welcome. This is Woodland Stable. Hey, I gotta know. Are you looking for stuff that fluffed in the sky too? Maybe. You don't know? Look up there, there's an island floating in the sky. You see it too, right? Nope. Sometimes when I'm looking at the sky, a big box falls down from that island. Oh, look! There! Look! Look! Yeah. And that means the sky person's gotta be dropping them. Eh. Not, not really, bud. I hate to break it to you. I always knew that there was a kingdom up in the sky, and I've always dreamed of going up there to play with all the sky animals. But I'm so little, I'm not allowed to go too far away. I want to hurry and be all grown up like you, mister, then I could go up there. You think I could get into the sky if I had lots of big balloons like the one on the other side of the ponds? 
creepers or something on the other side of the pond? Oh, there's a cave nearby. Because I think that's what those rabbits mean. I think. A soup ladle. Oh, a torch. Wait. Um, I think I need another egg soon. Oh, wait, that dude's still around. Oh, fuck yeah. The heck was his name? <laughs> Quentin, that's right. You're the traveler. Hmm. You have business in this cave by any chance, I'm sorry to say, but right now it's... Big Brother! Oh god, he's got a he's got a sibling. Colton, it's no use. Colton. Oh god, I'm gonna get these voices mixed up so much. Is it's impossible, absurd even to try to turn yourself into a legendary creature? Is Satori no less absurd? You should always be working on the monster collection with me instead of chasing a silly dream like that. Yeah, I will never give up, Clinton. It's always some sort of Satori, I will be a Satori. I would do not care what it takes. All I need to do is get my fingers on a bubble gym and then I'll shoot to turn into a Satori. And the rumors are true. There is even a creature in the cave called the Bubble Frog and it glows just like a Satori. God, but I don't think it would be up so high in the wild right now. Nimbly bimbly like that. In any case, little brother, why not go get someone to catch you one? Yes, do you remember all the treasure you collected? You can cover that and trade. You got you got need for these? Traveler, did you hear me and my big brother talking? If I'm going to take my dream come true, I must get my fingers on some gems. Bah, but they're so very nimbly mimbly and hard to catch. You want to hear about my dream? I mean, no, not really. I just have some things for you. Um, oh, simple, really. You're becoming a story. You know, the creature of myth. Stories of legendary creatures that have been spotted all over Hyrule. Piercing eyes, bluish white fur. Oh, I've, how I've admired them since I was a wee colored... I read these ancient texts and they told me how to transform myself, me, Colton, into a Satori. For to work, I must find a bubble frog, a strange creature that loves dark caves and glows bluish white like a Satori. Then I have to collect a bubble gem, which is a bottle that bubble frogs drop when they're feeling weak. So I have to chase after him, looking in the caves, and want to get my fingers on that gem. But who knew a bubble frog would be that? Or be a Satori. I will be a Satori, whatever it takes. I'm sorry. Oh, that's just my wish and my dream uh, reason for doing such things. Oh, if you get a hold of them, please give it to me. Here, take this. I have quite a few. That's a bottle gem. Colton, is it the real thing? Perfect shape and the faint blue glow. It's it's a real bottle gem. Realism can be. You did it. Now I can transform myself into Sotari just like the others. Please take this gift in return. Ooh. Nice. See, I collect all sorts of monstrous treasures. It makes you look like what, too? Just like a bubble is, uh, if it, you know. I always means to try it on. Then you will see what it's like to have the body and heart. At least, unless my time has come. Cheers, bottom up. Ah, my body is, isn't changing, but I do feel a strange sensation washing over me. Maybear thinks you're dumb. Probably because Maybear's dumb. More, I need more. When I catch this goblin up one at a time, no, that won't ever work. I must collect lots and lots and eat them all at once. And to do that, then to Big Brother, I've decided to start a journey to collect bubble drums. I see. Well, it seems you've made up your mind. That being the case, you have my complete support. Hope you can collect as many bubble drums as you need. Big Brother, thank you, thank you. 
I like how Clinton has become more sane in this one. And I'm gonna forget about that later on. They finally found a driver for your food. Hell yeah. Driver, I'm grateful for your help, but I've decided to set out on a journey. Yeah, I know. Hey, I got more. Wait, don't don't leave though, because I I have like a handful more. You're gonna leave, aren't you? Son of a bitch. Off he goes. I do hope he's able to make his dream come true. Now I've be on my way as well. I've got to be make it a thing. To hope that during your travels you'll find some time to assist you further. I'll keep my ears wide open for news of my brother's whereabouts. Of it. Oh, okay, so you're just gonna be set up and tear it down. Okay. Good. Well. That being said, there is a cave here. Uh, oops. I would like to mark this as one of those. I think we're going to mark caves like that. But we do have a torch now, so. I don't know if she's close enough for us. I hope not. Or I hope so, but I don't think she is. Oh. Welcome, Link. Would you like to register a horse? No, I'd like to just um, a customized horse. Uh, you don't have any horses. I wonder if there's new customizations. Oh, it's actually probably just the uh, harness thingy. Right? Yeah, I don't necessarily care about that right now. Um, it's fine as is, honestly. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, off we go, Cheryl. And this time we want to make sure that we're on the right way. Where's that smoke cloud? Oh, uh, it's a green fairy fountain, right? The fairy fountain, I should say. I don't know why I say the green one. I know that what you are, monster. You've come for my blessing of clothing enhancement. I've heard this land is now smothered in gloom and overrun with monsters. Oh, I'll never hear a musical trope pass by again or the sweet notes of its violin player. I'm staying sealed up in my flower bud for the rest of eternity, or until I hear a violin in the world once more. I came here to be close to a stable where I could offer my blessings to travelers, but now, until I hear a violin played by a musician in a troop, I can't bear the thought of ever going outside again. Alright, whatever. I'm sure I'll get on that soon. Honestly, it probably would be just as simple of a solution as going to talk to the people playing at the uh, thing down there and just be like, hey, you guys want to go talk? There's do the violin stuff. Play some violin. Near the great fairy fountain and then she'll come out of her shell and, and get my clothing enhanced and all that. Sorry, Cheryl. Alright, 
All right, so I am going to leave Cheryl right here, and then we have to go like this, go like so. Oops. Grab the torch and hope it works. I'm wondering It's only a side quest though I'm Wondering if it's because Of the trees So I wonder if we have to do that of Lindro's brow. Oops. Yeah, it was like right here. Oh, it actually does mark the cave if you go inside. Okay, good to know. Um, yeah, he was like right here. So I don't, I don't know. Genuinely done though. Um, I'm also now realizing that we didn't hit this shrine and there's another shrine off to the east. So, whoops. Yeah, I bet we have to help Hetsu out. And then Hetsu will then teleport into the thing and then we'll be able to go from there. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know why that person's just staring at the shrine, but it's my shrine. I will complete it. So we do have to kind of uh, try to make our way to more story areas, I guess. Combat training. You no, know, it's like that. I think we leave that shrine alone. Because uh, we don't have good weapons right now, nor do we have a whole lot of hearts. So, you know. And I'm wondering if we should go. I mean, I do also want to go to Hatsu. Or not Hatsu. Is it Hatsu Village? Whatever the village is that has the dye shop. I don't think it's Hatsu. Hatno Village, maybe? Hatno sounds right. Hatno sounds correct. Alright, and we go for this one. Hopefully this one isn't a combat one. A prone pathway. Interesting. Okay, so we have to go up then. Whoops. Send.
Oh boy. Oh god, that is nauseating. Also, not what I was expecting. Alright, there's a path right here. Leads us up to here for a chest, okay. Zonite charge noise. We do need to go back to one of the uh, things at some point, I suppose. Get more zonite stuff. There's a chest there. I don't think I can open it like this. Oh, I can. Interesting. I don't think we were able to in Breath of the Wild. Ten arrows, noise. There's another chest there. Um, I suppose we might as well get this chest. We almost fell out. Strong zone. Holy shit. Grab one of those. Um, hmm. somehow we need to make it all the way up top. So I can hit it multiple times. Interesting. How does that help me though?
You could get up on top of that. Doesn't really seem to do anything. We wouldn't necessarily be able to get up on top of that, I don't think. Wait, we can we can do it that way? So it Right. I don't want it to be going this way though. God damn it, how the hell did I do it before? Oh wait, can I Can I grab anything here? Um, I'm too dumb for this. I think I probably fucked it up. Hmm. We'll have to come back to this one, I think. We got the secret chest out of it, at least. Uh, is it going to look different? I think we have to walk away a little bit. Yeah, okay, we'll still have like the orange mark even though we got the chest from it. Good. Good, good, good. Another one of those motherfuckers over there. Jesus Christ. Are those going to be the new, um, I always forget the name of them. Lionels. I feel like those are going to be the new Lionels. And that's kind of terrifying. Hmm. I think we're going to call it there for today. But hey, if you're on YouTube and you want to suggest which region we should go to next, because we have this one, the, um, the one with Mifa's grace. What are those people? I don't remember what those people are called. The, um, not Rudo. What the? Why am I just blanking on it right now? The Zorro Domain. Nailed it. We can go up towards Elden Mountain, Death Mountain. Or we can go to the Gerudo area, because those are kind of like the three main areas that we still need to hit. And, uh, I think that's what we sh probably should do. Is, um, hit those, see what we can get for... You know people so if you want to suggest which way we should go you can leave it in the comments down below if you want and if you want to come tell me live which way we should go every tuesday thursday and saturday we are playing this live on stream over on twitch so be free to head in that description down below and uh come watch live if you want but apart from that if you want to stay on youtube that's fine because every monday wednesday and friday there will be a new video out just for you and if you really want to show your support, you can even like, subscribe, and even ding that little bell down there to get a notification as soon as the next video goes live. By the way, have you guys been able to find all of the hidden cones and all of the thumbnails? Because there's one in every single one. Some of them way more obvious than others. Some of them kind of tricky to find. But either way, we hope you all enjoyed. And I will see you all next time. Okay, bye.